U.S. Department of Agriculture programs to help producers protect the environment and make it through tough economic times have been around for a while. The Conservation Reserve Program, or CRP, has been around for 25 years. A recent sign-up showed that the program that helps farmers reduce soil erosion and protect wildlife habitat is still popular. The first time in four years we've had a general sign-up. And, uh, you know, you talk about some of the market dynamics. To see the amount of acreage we saw offered during that, that month-long sign-up, at the same time a lot of prices were, were increasing, is, I think, a great validator of, of how important folks see the program. But, as Kappa says, learning the best way to run producer programs is an ongoing process. We look forward to, to what more we can figure out as we go. What are some of the specific things we're seeing and hearing on the ground? The Farm Service Agency also runs safety net and loan programs to help producers to get started and stay in farming. One of our strong points of pride uh, with our lending programs is how much we get out to beginning and young farmers uh, to get those farmers started and then not just getting a loan out there but working with them on the business plan and on the operation so that we see them succeed. Coppa says FSA's programs are needed to keep younger producers on the land and attract new farmers to replace an aging farm population. In Washington, D.C., for the U.S. Department of Agriculture, I'm Bob Ellison.